Hi and welcome to this year's episode of Big Brother here in Home House. It's 2014 and we've got a special episode for you this year. I'm in the Big Brother house, so, and this is, this is our living room. It's very nice. Oh, I just sit down on this pink couch. Oh, well, I can imagine there's going to be a few arguments in here and all for your entertainment. Um, I actually really like the house this year. It looks really nice. They've got this fancy rug. It's actually been designed specifically for us by John Lewis, who, as you know, is a world-renowned designer. So, oh, look at this couch as well. Nice purple. <laughs> Lovely couch. This is <laughs> a really nice, really nice living room. Um, I'm actually really enjoying it. I think the housemates are going to love it. And I'm really happy that this is the first thing that they'll actually see. So that's really nice. But the moment you've all been waiting for is upon us. We can actually go and see the diary room. So if you'd like to follow me, we can go see the diary room, yeah? So in I go. Wish me luck. Oh, Wow, it's nice in here. Big Brother, are you there? Hello, Laura. Hi, Big Brother. Welcome to the Home House Diary Room. It's very nice. You've done a new decoration for 2014. You're looking good, by the way. <laughs> Thank you, Big Brother. Very flattering. Um, so, are you ready for the new housemates? Very ready. Got Just new, new things set up to go? Tasks well, and things? The jacuzzi is still getting set outside. Well, what do you expect from the contestants this year? I honestly haven't met any of them. I've not seen any of the tapes. It's all new for me as it is for you. I'm quite excited. So a lot of drama this year? I'm hoping so. It's always good with a bit of drama. Big Brother, can I ask you a question? Yes, Laura? Why, why are the rooms closed? Like, what's going on? Well, there will be a new task this year for all the housemates and it will require all the rooms to be open eventually. Oh, wow, that sounds really cool. How's that going to work? So basically, as new housemates come in, more rooms will be open. Oh, that sounds really good. So a bit like a weird task to start the house off with. Yes, Laura. Ah, should Kate create some nice drama for us. Most definitely. Right, well, I will see you, big brother, and I wish you all the best of luck this series. You too. Take care. Bye. Bill Henshaw, uh, history and French. Uh, not him. Well, I mean, some people have called me loud. Uh, which means often I can be clashing with quieter members of, uh, of, a, of a house. Uh, well, as I say, you know, quiet people sometimes jar with me or, well, find me irksome and sometimes I find them so, so yeah. Could cause friction in the future. Well, big brother, look out. I'm coming. Good evening, Bill! Good evening. Hi. Hello. How are you doing? Get on under this umbrella. I'm very well, thank you. Yeah, horrible, isn't it? Yeah, well, this is Britain. <laughs> True. So, are you looking forward to going in? Yes, ever so. Oh, you're excited. the first housemate. Are you excited? Yeah. Yes, well, that'll be nice. I can so sniff believe... around before yeah. everybody else gets in. So, we, we've been looking at your profile, yep. and we believe that your favourite thing are long bubble baths. Yes, yeah. yes. Well, I mean, it's a bit sad. Not, nothing much to uh, tout about, but I do enjoy a good bubble bath. Oh, that's good. Right, well, as much as I'd love to follow you up the umbrella, you might just have to sprint up the stairs, oh. okay? Well, thank you very much. Have a nice time. See you soon. Bye. My name's Elliot. I, uh, I study history, that's what I focus on. Oh, I'm, you know, I'm working on finishing my masters now. Um, I've got a massive fascination with uh, longbows, medieval longbows, that sort of thing. Uh, I'm really that dull, yes. I, I should say so. Um, I have to say, I'm a bit of a Trekkie. I do like my Star Trek. Um, just ask anyone I live with, they will know. Um, yeah, and I don't mind, uh, you know, other sci-fi stuff like that. I get, get a little bit excited about Pokemon too, why not? <laughs> Uh, I come from Wakefield, sunny, sunny Wakefield. <laughs> Note the sarcasm. <laughs> well, I don't know. I can. I tend to have a ability to pun occasionally, that which can be kind of annoying, I suppose. Um, I'm also, uh, you know, just ask my housemates about that one. They know about that one. But anyhow, um, 
you know, I, I like to try and get on with everyone as best as possible. Like, I reckon I can be quite annoying just talking about things like the weather if I can't think of anything else to talk about. I'm really that kind of dull. Uh, I suppose... Snooty people. People who are too far up themselves. They just... They're only thinking about themselves, I suppose. And I suppose... I suppose people who aren't necessarily from this country. I don't have any problems with them and stuff like that, but if they get a little bit like, oh, we wouldn't do this in my country or stuff like that, then it becomes a little bit tiresome, really, because we're such a cosmopolitan society nowadays. Yeah, I hope it's not going to be as bad as in previous series. <laughs> Um, so that's our first housemate, and our second one is actually Elliot, who I believe is allergic to orange flavouring. So the poor soul has never had a Jaffa cake in his life. How anyone can cope, I do not know. But anyway, let's get him out here. So, oh, the limo's arrived, and he's coming down, looking dapper in his suit jacket. Hey, how are you feeling, Elliot? Ah, uh, yeah, not too bad. The weather's a bit rotten, though. I know, they just pulled this up to fit you, wouldn't they? <laughs> yeah. Um, are you looking forward to going in the house? Yeah, why not? It could be a good laugh, this. <laughs> well, one housemate's already in there, Ooh. so yeah. Right. Um, very different. It Really? How different? I'm not going to say. You'll oh. have to figure it out oh, yourself. Oh, you're not at all. You look so much more fun <laughs> on TV. I'd love to follow you up the stairs with the umbrella. Unfortunately, I'm not allowed to. Right, so, okay. You want to get yourself up there? Yeah, that's up. great. Thank you very much. And in goes Elliot. My name is Yasmin Sarah Benrose. Um, I was born in the UK, but I spent my whole life in Switzerland, so I consider myself Swiss. Okay. Study sociology with criminology, but I'm switching courses to media studies. Um, I've had people in the past describe me as an excitable dog, like <laughs> puppy, because I get really hyperactive and I'm really random and I run around in circles a lot and pee a lot. Um, probably some, like, a male who's really camp and, I don't know, when men are overly feminine it just makes me uncomfortable. I don't think so. Hi. So, that's two boys into the house. Well, I'm, I'm, very quite excite I'm quite excited for our first female member to go in. I believe her name is Yasmin. And as you can see from the tape, she's quite an eccentric person. I believe she once worked to the circus, which is not a normal profession, I would say. So. Let's get Yasmin down here, so... Oh, I can see the limo pulling up, and Yasmin looks like she's stepping out! Yep, she's coming down the path. Oh, that's great. Okay. Oh, come on, quick, get under the umbrella. Whoop, before it blows away. <laughs> Hello, you are excited to get in the house? Yeah, it'd be great. So we got two housemates in there already, are you nervous? Now that you've said that, I am. <laughs> <laughs> you are our first female housemate. Ooh, yes. Oh, sorry. <laughs> no, no, that's a very good thing. I'd like to see how things shape up. So, Great. you want to go to the circus. What did you do? Um, I made and designed costumes and as a stage makeup. And so, no tightrope walking, no? Um, no, we did gymnastics performances. You went in, I did. Oh, okay, but that sounds quite cool. Right, well, I'd love to follow you up the umbrella, but unfortunately, you're just going to have to run. So. Oh, <laughs> brilliant. Thanks for that. No worries. <laughs> Enjoy time in the house. Good luck. Thank you. Bye. Bye. Austrian and Spain and stuff. I study languages. Um, 
German and French and Spanish. And um, um, I would like to think that I'm outgoing. Um, I, I don't really like geeky people, awkward, nerdy kind of people, so that might be a bit awkward, but uh, we'll see how that goes. Um, please don't do cool things to me. <laughs> so that's our first female in, and let's bring out another one, shall we? I believe this girl is called Mary. Um, she actually knows four languages. English, Spanish, French and German. That is impressive. She must have a well-trained mind. So let's get her out there. Oh, I can see the limo pulling up. And out steps Mary. Oh, it's good to see you. Hello. Oh, Hi. 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 Come into the umbrella. I, I realise I'm not raining anymore. That's great. Maybe you brought sunshine out, hopefully. <laughs> still got the umbrella though. Yeah, still got the umbrella. So, are you nervous about getting in the house? Uh, very. I don't know what anybody's going to be like, so this is going to be, yeah, this will be fun. Well, you're our second female housemate, so you're the first one, which is always a good thing. Good. So you've got another woman in there to keep your companion. And so, yeah, um, four languages, that's very impressive. I'm not, I'm not very good at all, so <laughs> Well, you're certainly good at English, so I, I'll let you get in there. I can't follow you upstairs, but it's not good anymore. Thank you. Bye. Wish you luck. My name's Josh. I study aquatic zoology. I'm from London. I am 19. I'm 20 in six months. Um, I'm quite loud, I'm quite bubbly, happy. Generally a nice person. Oh, I don't know, people who aren't clean. Small people make me feel a bit, uh, they're a bit, it's like I don't know, are you a child? Are you a person? I don't, are, you, are you a grown up? I don't know, it, it confuses me. Um, don't be too mean. I love you. I watch you every year. Um, yeah, I just want to get a good time. And so, right, we're on to our final housemate of the evening. And I know five seems a small number to go into a house, but we're trying something different this year, and I guess you'll hear about it tomorrow, when you have to nominate people to actually enter the house rather than evict, which will be really exciting. So let's get our last housemate out. I'm not sure if his profile is telling the 100% truth. However, according to his profile, Josh has slept with more men than in England. How he's done that, I'm not entirely sure. So, I believe we should get him out here and let him explain his wicked ways. So, oh, and there's the limo, right on time. And Josh is coming down. Hello. Oh, he's here. Hey, Josh. Oh, hi. Hi. Oh. Hello. Hello. It's raining again. What have you done? Blinking weather. So, would you care to explain yourself, Mr. Playboy? I can't, I'm more than Okay, okay. I right, will let you pop that. Are you excited about going to the house? I am. I can't wait. Oh, good. Um, th you are actually our last housemate this evening. Am I? Yes. How many minutes? Well, I can't tell you that. I'll have to see. Oh. Yeah. Sorry, it's in the contract. Oh, so many secrets. Yeah. So, um, have you got any interesting facts to tell us? No? Well, I think you've revealed all of my interesting <laughs> facts for everyone. Just the one. That's fine. Um, so I'll let you get on in there. You're going to have to run up and try not to get your hair wet. Yeah. Oh, sorry. I bye can't bye. Mwah. Mwah. Bye bye. Good luck.
They're quite comfortable though. Are they? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I prefer the sofa. What do you yeah. think we're going to have to do? How did you get a sofa all to yourself? <laughs> well, I'm. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's true. Maybe and wasting away. This <laughs> one is for Elliot, Bill, and Josh. Oh. Okay. So my first nursery rhyme will be for Elliot. Okay. And then we will continue on in that manner. Is everybody ready? Yeah. Yep. yep. Elliot, your first nursery rhyme. Twinkle, twinkle, little star. How I wonder what you are Up above the world so high Like a diamond in the sky Twinkle, twinkle, little star How I wonder what you are Thank you. Well done. That was really tense, actually. <laughs> <laughs> oh, got a tense nursery <laughs> yeah. They're any other kind. <laughs> I didn't know Big Brother was so musically talented. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> okay, so three blind mice, three blind mice. See how they run, see how they run. Uh, <laughs> oh, God. Oh, what? Oh, what my God. Heck? You felt that? Yeah, oh, I got that. It was like a little electric shock. Oh. That was horrible. Just Don't get it wrong sorry. again. <laughs> oh, my God. Me. I'm glad I picked the sofa now. Long pause. No. How good are you? I don't know. A nursery rhyme. Uh, yeah, I think I know about 30 uh, of the hundreds <laughs> like this. <laughs> well, that's good. Well, we're shocked. <laughs> How are you? Yeah, yeah, yeah true. Well, your hair's not frizzy yet, so we haven't got one. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> <laughs> yeah. You still look fabulous. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I would go oh, <laughs> Yeah, but they've got such a radiant glow when they did your picture. Sorry. Great. Okay, Josh. Yes. Are you? Ready? I think so. <laughs> Baba black sheep. 
Have you any wool? Yes, sir, yes, sir, three bags full. One for the farmer, one for the maid, one for the little boy who lives down the lane. Ba ba black sheep, <laughs> have you any wool? Yes, sir, yes, sir, three bags full. Um, like, um, yeah. Do I get the right? Yeah. Well, I don't yeah. know. I think you're supposed to do that. Congratulations, John. Yeah. Yeah! yeah. Oh. <laughs> Not you. Not you. Are you good? Oh, well, I think I I know Twinkle Twinkle the Little Star quite back. Well, you're the oldest, you should know. (laughs) (laughs) Oh, is that how we're based, isn't it? (laughs) Okay. I I can give it a go. Then again, the furthest distance from childhood. Oh, Oh, yeah. I don't think it should be you, because you did terrible. Oh, no. Yeah. You are the youngest. Elliot? Okay, I'll give it a go. Should we give a vote? Should we give a vote? Who says Elliot? Oh, okay. Right, okay, that would be easy. Not Elliot. Yeah. <laughs> Please don't okay. hate me if this goes horribly wrong. I think we decided, big brother. We'll just take Wherever you me. are. <laughs> I think your brother died again. Oh, yeah. Right, right. <laughs> I need to build some tension. <laughs> absolute tension for what the next round's going to be. I don't like the tension. No, I don't. Top of an electric chair. <laughs> Stool. Not, not appealing. Stool. I always wonder what an electrified stool would be. We will be right back. Oh, it's the ad break. <laughs> We're at the uh, ad break. This is where it always happens. It was in Shanghai, Shanghai. Not if you're in the Well, he it's seating. Then again, it's a stool and a chair. You can't sit on a chair. You need many of your wings, don't you? Possibly. I know. That's a fair point. I've got around to it yet. Oh, you wearing blue? No, it's because I went to a party so before. So if you were to lie yeah. down on the chaise lounge, no. you wouldn't have Let them done for that. No. Oh. Well, but then again, the chaise lounge is the chaise lounge. Ah. You saw us in the premiere chair and some research. I know. I wore black for the premiere, so it went. It was fine. Red and black goes quite nice, so I didn't have to. I mean, if you yes, I do like the seats like a are there in the room, then that changes the whole like dynamic, sure. Very, old school true. classy. Mm. Yeah. Yeah, oh, I, mean, I, mean, <laughs> I, I like the little... Oh, 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 Its fleet was white as snow, and everywhere that Mary went, the lamb was sure to go. <laughs> was, is there another? Is there another verse? There was a second Mary had a little lamb. Really? Yes. yes. I will continue on, but I will start you off properly. This is an alternate version of the nursery rhyme. Ooh. Oh come on! Oh, <laughs> not That's fair. Not fair. Oh. Not that Mary had a little lamb, little lamb. Um, <laughs> I don't know this version. <laughs> <laughs> um, you'll only conduct if you hold hands. Everywhere that Mary went, the lamb was sure to go. Please. <laughs> Right, the version that I did was. Yeah. Uh, you would have thought we'd know this version. Yeah. Yeah. All right. It's like being and thank you, House. If one member of the House would like to go into the diary room, you will be presented with the shocking budget. Shall I go? You go. Yeah. Mm. Quickly, someone jump, jump, jump into his seat now. Get off the electric stools. Get off the electric stools. <laughs> I'll be having conversations with someone and she'll just all sit there and stare at me. I don't feel like we have any kind of connection. I've kind of made friends with everybody else. Pretty good. I think I've made a couple of friends. There's a couple of people that I don't really get on with that well. All right, but it's only that you're talking on and on and on about it. And honestly, I don't want to know, all right? It's a problem, I understand, but God, leave it alone, will you? I'm not interested. Well, just, uh 
I feel she's a bit ganged up upon by the other members of the house. So uh, if one of those goes, then maybe it'd be better for her. And, oh, she's nice enough.